What's up, Pirate Army? Arg or Alexandra here today, and I'm bringing you into my closet. Except for this case, we have to be outside my closet. But I figured I'd show you my shoe collection. So if you're interested, thumbs up the video. Make sure you subscribe so you can be part of the Pirate Army family. And let's get into the video. Alright, so my first pair of shoes I'm going to show you are sneakers. So I have these. They're the champions. They're just black and with a little bit of pink. Um, I normally wear these every day when I help my mom out with nannying. They're great running shoes. Um, I have other running shoes that I will have pop up and stuff like that. Some are orange. Then I have pink Converse. Um, a purple pair that have like roses on them and stuff like that. So my other pair of shoes is all the way over here. These are my newest ones. They're by Airwalk. They're just the Charcoal Converse. Um, these I tend to wear mostly with um, my leggings because they are a newer, nicer shoe. I like to keep them that way. So I generally wear these with leggings or um, dresses, depending on if I'm going for more of a skater look with my dress. Alright, so then just some more comfortable inside wears. I have a pair of um, Airwalk slippers. Like that, they, they just have like this little string here that's more for design. And then another new pair that sort of combines sneaker with slipper are they're another Airwalk pair, but they're sort of, they look like this. They got the shoelace and then they have snaps on the sides. So then it can go all the way up to be a high top. I'm probably going, I haven't worn these yet because it's summertime out here in Arizona. So I'll probably wear these more for the fall or if I decide to wear them, I'm probably going to pair them like um, with leggings and stuff like that. Or skinny jeans. Okay, so moving on, sort of still sticking with the whole almost everyday sort of flat look. As I have a pair of flats like this. These I wore for my high school graduation. They're more of a spring shoe. They have different flowers. Um, this, they're by the Brass brand. So I have those. And then, because the concrete gets so hot out here, so I do have a pair of swimming shoes. They're just basic pink and black. Easy to slip on. Um, so let's move on to sandals. Because with the getting summertime, every girl is going to be wearing either flip-flops, sandals, or some form of an open toe shoe. So I got these. I literally fell in love with these. They're just also by the brass brand. But they reminded me of like Egyptian shoes with how they lace up and stuff. They're super cute. I was actually wearing these. I wear these with everything. Shorts, leggings, capris, um, pretty much anything because they're super cute. They're very open and yeah, they just sort of remind me of that like um, Egyptian goddess feel. So those are like my favorite summer wear. And then if I'm going out to like a picnic type thing, I'll probably class it up with a basic white flip-flop with a little bit of a wedge. Um, but it's super pretty because once again, you can wear these with jean shorts, pretty much anything again. But I loved it. I actually wore these last year for my birthday. They look super cute with this gold um, design right there. Super classy. Um, and then just sort of a casual pair I've had for a while are these just basic, they're like a copper brown. So like down here is more of a shiny copper on the heel and stuff, so it's more of a wedged flip-flop. Um, this is a Madison, I think that's what it says. They're so old that the name's worn off. But these I just sort of like know where if I go to the beach and stuff like that. They're not as fancy as my other ones. Um, so then some of my newer ones, again, if... I want to class it up a little bit. These are by American Eagle. They have like a fake wood wedge type of design all the way around it. And then just sort of a jean looking strap met in the middle with a gold loop. So those are all my sandals. Um, I don't remember all the prices on them, but um, then I guess I also have this pair if you want to get into a higher heel for a wedge for the summer. It's got this... um. Mesh, not really mesh, but it's um, ropey stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's the word, Alex. Um, no, it's like basically rope and everything. That's the texture. It goes all the way around, and then it's got this blue little bow right there. And then it just has a heel part right there. This is by the 
Mosimo Supply Company. Um, so then moving on to more of a, um, basically my favorite shoe of all are heels. I'm obsessed with heels. Anytime I go shopping with shoe related, literally my mom is telling me, she'll be like, Alex, you're looking for tennis shoes, tennis shoes only. Because if she just says, oh Alex, go pick out a pair of shoes, I'm going to literally bypass flip flops, tennis shoes, and go for the very impractical right now, high heels. Most of my closet um, is some boot with a heel or a high heel pump, stiletto, you name it basically. I have it probably. So, starting off my high heel collection are these cute little, um, they remind me of like, um, oh, I don't know the name of it right off hand. But, um, if you see it, comment below what this reminds you of. Um, it's got this much of a heel, but it's a thicker heel. So it's not as annoying to walk on or difficult if you struggle with walking. And then instead of like a normal shoelace, it's got like more of a ribbon type thing. And I loved it because I wore these to my uncle's, no, scratch that. Or maybe he's an uncle. I don't know. One of my family members' wedding and stuff like that. And these looked super cute with a long maxi dress. Super cute. Love these. Um, they are also by American Eagle. But no, they're super cute. They remind me sort of like, not like a clog shoe, but like, you know, little like... That's so weird, I feel like I'm stereotyping, but like, they're so cute and to me they're like almost like a vintage type because of what they remind me of. So comment below what you think they remind you of because to me I'm like not going to get the right term and I feel like I'm going to find like so many people. But to me they remind me not like clog shoes, but like you imagine a little make girl, like some like type of shoe that would be like in that era if that makes sense. So that is my back row of my shoes. So now we're going to move up to the more pointy shoe mixed with boots. So in Illinois, I got these in Illinois. Um, so I actually didn't really buy these actually at a, like a shoe oriented store. Um, so I have no idea the brand of these. It doesn't even say. But anyways, I saw these, loved them. It's got more of a sharp, skinny heel. It's got a nice zipper in the back of the heel, open toed, but this pretty mesh is black and gold and it is so cute it's got little flowers and stuff on it and then the back of the heel is velvet so cute loved these and they were on clearance at the resale shop loved them and then I love the Christian Sarum let me try it again the Christian Serrani or Serrano sorry it sort of fell off he does a lot of um, Payless brands and stuff. So I saw these and I had to have them. They're very simple, but to me they're like super cute. It's got another skinny heel. Um, it's more of a cork type wood design for the heel part. But then you have this pink and just white design. Super cute. Alright, so I have to take those off the box. So in my lovely brass box here are my all-time favorite shoes. I would wear these so much more, but I have to keep getting, I forget to get them sprayed. But I saw these in, yeah, Waukegan in Illinois, and I had to have them. Once again, it's a skinny heel and stuff, and then it's just, looks like that at the bottom. I'm an eight and a half in heels. My whole shoe design, like my shoe size thing is so weird. Um, but anyways, it's a nice, beautiful red. And if you know me, I love red. If you couldn't tell with my newly dyed red hair, um, <laughs> I'm obsessed with the color red. It, to me, it's just my go-to. So when I saw these, and they're not even like, the texture is just so pretty. It's um, felt, basically. So I was always super cautious with those to leave those out and everything. But probably the only pair of shoes I actually paid full price for were probably those right there. Alright, so... Moving on down the line are my newer heels. Um, to me, they're sort of more like could wear with anything type of thing. They have a very nice thick heel, which is super in right now. And then it just has this pretty 
um, open tied up part that comes together. Um, this I this is a size eight, so but this is the Christian Serrano brand as well. Apologies if I'm butchering his name. Um, but yeah, no, they're just same thing like my red ones. They're all black, um, and they have that felt type material. Super cute. I wore these with my skinny jeans. Um, could wear these with a pencil skirt. You could pretty much find any way to um, style these with anything that fits your style. Love those. And then had these for a while, but they're an oldie and a goodie. Um, probably my first pair of boots I ever had. Um, they're leather, um, very ripped up and beaten <laughs> and stuff, just from all the wear and tear use I've worn in them. But no, I literally traveled with these. These I believe I probably wore in my graduation pictures. Um, I, I'm not going to really show you those up close because just from them even probably sitting in my closet, the fabric's just shredding at this point. So I'm probably not going to end up getting rid of those because if I do go wear them out, they're not going to be very attractive. But they have a side zipper, um, a little bit of a heel. Um, but all around, I love, they're even super comfortable. I wore them when I was traveling on a plane. They're like my shoes I wore on my plane, right? <laughs> um, another one of my favorite boots, all black, all leather. Um, and it's just got two little buckles on the sides right there. Um, inside zipper, a little bit of a heel. Um, to me, these are great if you're going to Coachella. Um, I actually paired these up because I didn't get to go to, I didn't... Um, have enough money to go to Coachella and stuff, but I had a super cute outfit that I had paired these with that sort of, you know, with Coachella going on and stuff that like made me feel like, oh, I'm part of Coachella, but I'm not really. I basically paired it with my jean shorts and then my black top and then I wore a pink no sleeve long jacket sort of and then paired them with these. These I wear with everything. You've probably seen multiple photos on Instagram of me in them. Um, with my leggings and different things. Alright, so I'm just going to pop this box over. Okay. So, another pair that I have not had time to spray is by Velvet Heart. Um, I got this um, at Sears back home. But they're super cute. So, without here, I can probably wear them a lot more because we don't have all the snow and the rain and stuff like that, but however we do have a lot of dust, I'm probably going to have them spray. But they're a skinny heel, but they're knee-high boots. Super cute. It's got this sort of like ridged thing. Long zipper in the back. Love these. Once again, jet black, velvet, super comfortable actually. I love these shoes. Um, they are a fave of mine. Question is how do I get them back in the box? Partly why I don't open them. <laughs> You'll help us know. So I paid. Okay, so these are originally ninety dollars shoes, and on sale I got them for twenty dollars. I wore these. Um, Super cute, actually. I've had some great ideas to wear these with. So, currently I'm wearing all black leggings, so I pair them with that so it sort of looks like they blend. And then you could wear a um, plaid or flannel shirt with it, sort of go with that fall, sexy look. Or, if you just want that whole party New York, or not New York, New Year's Eve look, I wore mine with my Christmas shoes. I believe I paired them again to my jet black leggings to have that sleek look. And then I believe I wore a red shirt with a plunging neckline, sort of. Not really plunging, I guess. But anyways, I got these for $10 because, um, oh, what's that? Just Fab does that company. If you, like, buy, like, sign up, become the member, you get your first pair of shoes for $10. Saw these, super cute. There's no zipper, so you probably want to get them roomy so you can slide your foot in there. But a little bit of a heel, but not much. It's a thicker heel, so it's more of a boot type thing. Um, love it. It's, like, that gray color. Um, it's got three buckles on the sides that do tighten this part and loosen it. I have mine all the way to the end, but that's what it looks like. So that is basically... 
So that is my shoe collection. Um, if you want to see more um, inside my closet, sort of, my organization, then make sure you leave a um, thumbs up and or leave a like. Basically just smash that like button. Um, and make sure you turn on that little notification bell to become part of the Pirate Army family. And don't also subscribe um, to see more Pirate Army things. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you thumbs up the video. Comment below what pair of shoes you like the best or which ones you wear. Mostly, if that makes sense. I'll see you guys all next week.